So I just installed um, some new custom share buttons to my website. You can see here at the bottom of this post. And I wanted to share with you how I created these custom share buttons. And um, so what I did is I used this plugin called Share Buttons by Add to Any. And so in the back end, if you go to your plugins and you do Add New, sure search for share buttons by add to any and I already have it installed so I activated it and then in the settings area you now have this new menu item called add to any so if you click on that menu item you're brought to the add to any page and um, in my previous video I showed you some options for different plugins um, like this where you can create share buttons and so by default it lets you create share buttons with the regular icons but I wanted to create some custom um, share buttons so what I did is I, if you scroll down here and you cl click this custom icons URL and um, so what I did is I pointed it to um, a folder on my website where I uploaded some new icons so um, to do that you go to your media section and add new and this is where you're going to install your icons. So I have mine on the desktop here. So these are the icons that I installed. Um, so these four right here. And um, so what you're doing is you're kind of replacing the default icons that's used by this plugin. So you have to make sure that you name them properly. So Google Plus is named Google underscore plus, um, Twitter, Pinterest and Facebook.png. So I created these images in uh, Photoshop and then I just uploaded it to my WordPress um, media section. And um, I'll show you where I have them here. And so once you upload your images, um, then if you click on edit, and you'll see this file URL right here. So you want to copy that path. Just right click and copy that. And then if you go back to your uh, settings section, add to any, then that is the URL that you're going to use right here. So you paste that right here and then you save your changes. And then when you go to your website, you'll see that these are the new images that you have here. And so you might wanna play around with the different sizes. Uh, yeah, I created mine using Photoshop, but I also found this cool little website that um, allows you to create icons and maybe change the background image. It's called socialicon.com. I'll put it in the post, I'll link it in the post notes and you can create squares or, um, or circles and you can uh, change the background color. So that might be a cool um, tool here for some icons that you can use um, that might fit your theme. But yeah, it's as easy as that. Um, it's the, again, it's the add to any plugin and um, yeah, that's it for this week's theme or this week's video and um, I hope you enjoyed it and if you want to see more then please subscribe or follow me on Facebook or other um, of my social media sites.